Hello everyone, my name is Emrath and welcome back to Game Dev Tycoon. Now in the last part we just basically completed the game, but that doesn't mean that we're done with this game. So we're going to go back in and I don't really remember what we're doing, it seems we're making a horror game. Alright, we have 400 million in the uh, bank, but there's still a lot that we can do. Like I was watching uh, Dual Gamer Floki's playthrough of this and I noticed that we don't have a research, research center. And we don't have something to create our own uh, computers. So I'm actually uncertain whether we are going to be able to do that once we actually complete the game. I mean, I hope I will. And if we can't do it, I will probably just keep doing this. I mean, it's still fun. It's still a lot of things that I want to do. Alright, so we have reactive quests. Alright. Can be useful. Um, so first of all, what should I do? First, game support. I would like you to research, uh, we have 80 points, so maybe um, moral choices, maybe world design, sound, dialogue, I'm going to go for how about dynamic environment, no loading screen, <laughs> I wish that was possible, alright let's see, so Scream, it seems that it's going to be a pretty good game, a 10, still hoping for that perfect game. And we didn't make it. <laughs> oh well. A 10, a 9, and another 10 is pretty good. It's probably going to be a 10. Yeah, just one off from that achievement. Oh well. It's not that bad. It is not that bad. Right, here we go. Going up to 2.5 million. So it's 1 million and still going. Uh, we wonder how many more it will sell. Yeah, I'm wondering too. I think it's going to be quite a lot. Right. And you should, should research um, government. Yeah, maybe government. And then, friend. My good old friend, you will do life. Research life. We should go over that Scream has reached up to 5 million. And I think we're going to make it 10. Yeah, it's going steadily. Uh, I've been playing Scream. Right, so, best game ever from Gary White Gamers. Seems that adventure games are popular. So that's time for us to make a great adventure game then. Right, uh, gameplay, gameplay is not very important. This is bad actually. PlayStation and adventure is bad, so... Hmm. So besides that little bad thing. Yeah, 10 million. An incredible achievement. I'm going to go for a large booth. Can we, we can afford it. So how about... We make a large game, and let's pick a topic. Let's make it a um, adventure as popular. So, what would be good with adventure? A um, uh, I don't know, a medieval adventure action game. Yeah, maybe. Um, for the let's see, adventure is bad. This um, for the what else? What else? What else? Um, M box maybe, and maybe the PPS. It's not support lore. Oh, that's a problem. So what else then? This might as well just buy it, and of course newest engine. So a medieval adventure game. Um, how about um, I don't know, Rogue. Knight. Rogue Knight. A game where you're knight and you go rogue. <laughs> Alright. Seems that we're going maybe to 15 million. Alright, so um, I want a well, gameplay engine. I should balance it out a bit. We get this. We have multiplayer, this, this, maybe a bit more, maybe this, no, this. I want multiplayer. And achievements. Do it like this. Like this. Alright. And probably after this I'm going to go for a general training round. Mm, maybe. Hmm. 
I want to do a bit of research, make a new engine, and get all the topics, and then train our people. Yeah. Getting a lot of people here. Really, a lot. Right, here we go. One million, almost two. And we got 2.7k fans out of that, I think. Oh, no, 13.4. Getting a lot of fans. Um, an interview, yes. We will focus on world design. I think. <laughs> you see? Agree. They agree with me. Alright. Very good. So, it was world design, not level design. So, do it like, yeah, like this, I guess. Hmm, yeah. Dialogues are very important, it seems. So, trend and focus. Maybe... We can relieve some pressure of him. Like this. Um, yeah, Ivan. Charles is a bit overworked. But Ivan's still okay. And then maybe like this. Yeah. Level design, maybe no Easter eggs, no mini games. It's not really worth it. Do it like yeah, like that. Oh, like this, okay. Sure. We'll put everything. Just anything. Oh, reached over fifty million. It is making us a lot of money. It's still number two. Still number two. Alright, who's making those big bubbles? Let's see. Trying to spot where they come from. Some people will need a vacation after this. Alright, so world design, as we said, very important. You do this, Trendon, you shouldn't be doing that. Like, take over and take over. So, sound is not important. Surround sound, nope. No need. World design, everything, and graphics are okay. We have advanced zero topic 3D, and we have 3D graphics version 5. Bugs. Um, Alright. So I will actually develop a patch right now. Take a quick break. Although I don't remember putting any bugs in any game. I also didn't read which one it was. Let's see. Whoa. 251 million. <laughs> That's a lot. Did we actually put marketing on there? I mean, the hype is going. But we're not having any campaigns on it, so... Maybe marketing. With a large campaign. I mean, we can, we can afford it. We can really afford it. Alright, get the bugs out, everyone. I love companies like Lambert Games. I, they just, yeah, they don't, yeah, all right, all right. It's about the patch we released, so. We sure we care about our gamers. All right, get those bugs out. I think it's going to be a pretty decent game, I guess. I mean, I forgot a bit about uh, how much design, how much technology we had before. Um, but Adventure is a hype right now. And, yeah, things going to be good. More dialogues, more 3D graphics, and Ivan. Very good, Ivan. Right. Realistic body language. So you, I'm going to do this. You, on a vacation. And let's see. Things going to be decent. Not great, decent. Yeah, six. Another six. So just a overall okay game, I guess. Maybe another seven. Alright, shows potential. All right. I can agree with that. To you, vacation. You, vacation. Fire. No. Oh, alright. You're already gone. You. And at least you, Bill. So you're going to do some research for me. Um, how about orchestral soundtrack? Hmm. Advanced body language. Maybe do like that. Dialogues, video games, engine, advanced physics. Yeah, maybe physics. That's for the engine, so if we get the next one we can put in not just basic physics, but good ones. 500 million in K. Uh, in sales, I mean. And we're going to go for 1 million. Yep, yeah, there we go. 1 million. Mm -hmm. 
and at one point when somebody's back we should do some more oh wait quick combination it's not bad it's good and it's great more insight yeah that's just one break I took come on give me a break um law maybe a new research a new topic of martial arts all right and now we just wait a second for everybody to be done with this research and we can maybe I'm just going to check if you make a new one we can put in advanced physics we can put in this dynamic environment self-learning AI and that's it so I'm going to wait for, I'm going to wait for a second and topic and topic all right maybe do a sequel a sequel to um, should go back a bit Loch Ness Hunt, or Hunting Simulator, or Haunted Mansion, or a horror game. Mm hmm. Transport. How about. Yeah, do this one. So we got Space Trader, we got. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Call of Demrat, Heroes, My Future City, Son of Shotgun. We got. Yeah, Wasteland, some, some Wasteland, and. Call of Demrat, Cold War. Maybe another Call of Demrat, actually. Yeah. So I'm going to continue with the saga. Call of Demrats. Alright, now my history is should be okay. So after the Cold War, another war. The war on on Terror. Alright. Large game, military. Oh. Uh, military action for the this one for the PC and for action question mark yeah this one all right let's see if we can make something great out of this let's just see gaining fence doing good so like this story quest is not important um, you take over you um, do no, not really. Charles is okay. Charles is really okay. So engine, everything. I think. No mod support. No save to cloud is actually better. Gameplay, story and quest shouldn't be this. It should be better with this. Simple cutscenes, or maybe without. No, simple cutscenes and what just just a branching story. Yeah. No cutscenes in Call of Duty or Call of Demrat. Just a, a branching story. Um, where you can like focus like an American guy who's fighting terror and maybe a Belgian guy I mean if I would make a game I would put a lot of um, attention to what Belgium does in any war not that we do that much we just send fighters over there <laughs> it's like who's going to join the war we Belgium will join the war right what do we send uh, two fighters yeah yeah that's all yeah no 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 we won't pay for the fuel you can just use them <laughs> Alright, so enough about uh, foreign politics. We can just focus on our game here. The war on terror is on. Right, put this down. And let's see, you're overworked, Ivan. So um, I will take over from you this. And AI should be everything. Dialogue shouldn't be anything, I guess. Just this. Better dialogues than dialogue tree. Or maybe voiceover. Or this. Um, I guess this one. Level design, everything, everything. So maybe a bit more into AI, actually, if we can. Let's see. Oh no, wait. Oh, it's alright. I'm going to see after we we're done. To see if we have any improvement for the AI. Rogue Knight sold for 39 million. I think that's alright. Let's see in our history. Rogue Knight brought us a profit of 35 million. This a lot more, of course. How much did the Loch Ness thingy bring in? Not that much. Hmm, alright. And in a minute I'm actually going to do something that I saw as well in a, one of Jill Germer's Loki's videos. Um, remember the link is down below, so if you want to check out his uh, playthrough as well. He hasn't finished the game yet, but he did unlock those extra areas that I'm waiting for right now. So go down, put this up a bit, and sound. 
surround sounds, graphics, everything, and world design. No, no, no. Just day and night, yeah, day and night. Or maybe a rich background. Yeah, I like this more. Alright, hoping to get uh, like 2 million here. Yeah, let's aim for 2 million. With our big stand for Call of Damrat to War on Terror. Yeah, getting closer, getting closer. Seems like 100 million. Uh, no, not 100 million. 100,000 more people than last year. It seems. To a bit of marketing. A big campaign with everything like magazines, reviews, behind the scenes reports, TV trailers, and more. Alright. Getting a very big hype. I think it's going to be pretty good uh, design and technology wise. We do have some bugs, but that's okay. And Bill is now in need of a vacation. Alright. So get the bugs out. Come on. And here we go. Alright, so maybe let it tick for a while. No problem, just letting everybody put in some more details. And I think we're done. There we go. A hype or a record in technology. We are on our yeah. Three people got a level up, and they all got a race, costing me more and more money. You vacation, and I will generate game sports. While um, no, you maybe after review. I think it's gonna be a good game. Yeah, here we go. Very good game. I'm happy for it, because together with, um, what is it, Space Trader and Wasteland, this, these are some of the um, games that I, well, I remember, let's see. Oh, damn it, so close. Yeah, those three games are really my favorite ones that I uh, came up with. Uh, the other ones, I, well, if I look back, I see like, oh yes, this game, this game, but I'm very proud of the other ones. So, I said AI here. Um, no loading screen. Hmm, maybe. Dialogues. I think we should put a bit into dialogues. I mean, we got a lot in story and quests, so. Maybe sound. Yeah. Let's just get it out of the way. And the topics. Racing. You. To. A. Fantasy. A prison. That'd be cool. Alright. Sold 1 million. And. Let's see. I think it's going to go for. Mm, 10 million, I guess. It's not as good as, um, what was it? I actually forgot. Like, uh, Scream, that was it. So I might actually do another horror game. Hmm, I might. But we do need good sound for that. Best game ever, thank you. Alright, so you research a new topic. I just want to get down there, we're almost there, so Wild West. Um be important, alright, good. And I'm actually happy that we are like on a stable level right now, there are not uh, any more devices coming in, not any more systems or so, so we can just learn about all of them and really make good games for them. So 10 million, right, getting those things in. And right now for the minutes we have left, I'm actually going to do some contract work, because I think our team, well, I, I haven't been doing this because we actually got a penalty from one, um, but I think we're uh, able to do it right now. So, our staff needs to be taught how to use these modern technologies, right? Work on it. Yeah, as you can see, no problem here. So I'm just going to make some easy cash here. 55, contract work. Um, create a revolutionary AI for a vacuum robot. Should be easy enough. Right. Getting some research points. More, more contract work. Uh, help a help to pl play test a game. I can't speak. Here we go. And more. How about a? I just get the easy ones. Design some simple backgrounds. All right. Don't really know if big uh, game studios do this actually. Like contract work. Should be a good way to make some money. 
We need an application that looks futuristic for a movie. Alright. Uh, wait, okay. Boss, we should like... We would like to stage an internal, internal coding test. I think we could learn a lot. Um, mm, we agree that the price would go to charity. Sure. 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 So they're all... Oh, crap. That was actually bad. But I couldn't do anything about it, I guess. So they're all working. And, yeah, we failed. How much did it cost? 51. Uh, that's a lot of money. But at least we're doing that uh, training round I wanted. So once everybody is done... Um, we might as well just end it here. We got some pretty good games in there. We got a great, great, great uh, sequel to Call of Damred. A new game in the saga. And I'm going to end it here. So in the next part, I would like to research more. Maybe make a new engine. And get all the research done and do a general training round. Or chain it training a session. Probably in the meantime I'm going to do some contract work and maybe level up our guys a bit uh, so that we don't have to see everything. But I'll see. So anyway, if you liked it then like and subscribe for more and remember to share this video with your friends and family to help me grow my channel and remember to check out my Facebook page and my Twitter page. It should be all down below. So anyway, see you guys in the next part. Bye!